Hi everybody, we're going to do a Q&A. We're going to talk about the Laura Piana Pecora Nera cloth. And uh, we've actually made it up as a garment, well, two garments this season. So we've made it up as the Model 6 Double Breasted for the collection this season. And also wow, as the Model 3 Single Breasted this season as well. So um, what's the deal with this? What is Pecora Nera? Pecora Nera means black sheep wool. And what happens is Laura Piana basically has a flock of black sheep and they harvest the wool and they turn it into this undyed black sheep wool cloth, which has a lovely color and texture to it. And you know, I suppose because they don't dye it, it also has a little bit of a different hand. Like it's a little bit kind of silkier and smoother and has a nice sort of natural feeling to it. So I'm into it, Picornera. All right, how do you put together Picornera in terms of outfits? Well, uh, I'm wearing this navy blazer today because you could basically use Picornera the same way you might use a navy blazer. You know, like that really nice dark brown, relatively flat tone is very, very similar in terms of how you might style it to how you might do a navy blazer. Um, we've got two outfits here. This one is a slightly more dressy one. In fact, this one was actually done by my partner, Alan C. And my producer, Sam, was just saying to me, you know, we should feature more outfits that Alan puts together. And he's right, because actually the outfits Alan puts together tend to be a little more colorful, and they are something that maybe I wouldn't necessarily put together myself, but I actually really like them. Uh, so here we go, a little bit more dressy. We got the necktie, pocket square, striped shirt, and to go with that, a pair of Yohei Fukuda Oxfords as well. Long wing Oxfords, no less. Um, next, let's have a look at something a little bit more casual. Uh, so, you know, just to show that the coronary can, just as you would with a navy blazer, be used in a more casual way. Um, here we've got it with a sporty striped shirt, with a white pocket square, with our Nigel Keyboard jeans. And I think it actually would look great with a pair of Moonstar sneakers like that. I think that is a good match. All right, let's have a look at what the Picornera looks like on the body. Um, so I'll show you the Model 6 first. So here's the Model 6, and yes, it is a little dressier than the Model 3, given that it's a double-breasted, um, but you know, you could definitely still wear it in a smart, casual way, as we're going to show you. Uh, also, one little tip, if you wanted to, you could actually have the buttons changed. Um, so these are dark horn, dark brown horn, uh, but this would actually look really great with a mother of pearl as well. And in fact, I, wanted, I wore this specific navy blue blazer because this one does have mother of pearl buttons. And you know, it's just like a different thing, but it's, uh, it looks good. Like it's not too gimmicky. So there's the double breasted. Now let's have a look at the single breasted model three. There we go, that's the model three. Um, we've done both of these models with patch pockets. Um, the reason is that we wanted something that was you know, something that you could dress up or dress down. Patch pockets are always going to be the more casual of the pocket configurations, um, but at the same time, they wouldn't necessarily look out of place with a pair of gray trousers either. Okay, let's do some styling. Uh, so we've got this, the double-breasted Picornera. And, you know, something that I like doing with earth colors, is I like putting black with it because it's not something you see too often, but actually matches quite well. Here we've got an Armory Polo shirt in black cotton. It's a button down version we have. And then you can put that with a pair of gray slacks like that, single plea. And then uh, for shoes, I would actually suggest these. There's black tassel loafers like that. I think that's a great match. Okay, and this would be something that was a little more smart, casual, um, unusual, and interesting, which is always a good way to dress. Alrighty, next, let's look at something maybe in the same sort of smart, casual vein, but more colorful, a little lighter, a little brighter. Um, let's have a look at this. So we've got cream pamela trousers. This is actually my personal pair. 
Um, and in fact, if you're wondering what this thing is, this is for the Pamela belt. So this actually goes through like that, doubles over and buttons. It's a design that I came up with for Gianluca when he first started the brand, because they wanted to have, you know, I felt like if you start a brand, you gotta have like some unusual design, something that people at least will remember you for, even if you tend to just sell kind of more basic options. All right, let's do this with the single breasts like that. I know I just pulled out that navy next to the cream trousers, and the navy does look good, but personally, I actually prefer the gray. I think the gray is a little bit more unexpected, um, and it sits really well with this. I don't think you need to wear a shirt with this. I think actually it would look great with just the gray crew neck on its own, or if you wanted to put a t-shirt underneath it just to separate yourself from the wool, uh, you could absolutely do so. Um, in terms of shoes, I really like these. This is the new Bowdoin and Lang Stride that just arrived in Hong Kong a couple, uh, about a week ago. And um, it's a very unusual color, like kind of, they call it clay. Um, and it's, you know, a little bit lighter than snuff suede, but I think it looks really good. And you get this beautiful color crescendo going from like the clay to the white to the dark brown like that. Of course, if you want something a little more conservative or a little bit less kind of unusual, you could use dark brown suede as well. Um, finally, Let's do something that's a little bit more on the casual side. So we have our Armory Sport Chino, which is our washable Chino. And then our new Jumor Crew Neck Polo, oh sorry, Polo Neck crew Polo. And then a Picorn Nera Blazer to go with that. And then to finish that off, we, I would use this. Um, dark Brown Duane Loafers. I really like the grain with this. I think that this sort of grain actually matches really well with things like the Sport Chino, where it's like a little bit more of a textured fabric, a little bit harder. Alrighty, um, that is all the examples I'm gonna give for now. If you have any suggestions of your own, we would love to hear them. Um, the jackets are available online and in store, and we are also able to do custom versions of the jackets because the cloth is actually available as a cut length. So if you want to do like a made to measure version, we absolutely could take care of you on that as well. That's about it for now, and thank you for watching.